Hi friends, Radhika Ravikova here. So in this tutorial, we'll see what is a subquery in SQL. So as the name suggests, suggests uh, subquery is nothing but is a nested uh, query inside a larger query. Okay. So where and all our subquery will occur is it first uh, it can occur after a select loss. Okay. That is whenever we are saying select uh, employee name from employee table. So once after the select clause, you can write your subquery, and then even you can use it when you are writing a from clause, when you are going to specify your um, you know table name, and also you the most uh, commonly used is when we are writing our where condition. So when uh, we know that whenever we are saying where, we are going to specify our condition. So instead of specifying the condition, we can put your put your um, subquery over there. So the subquery will uh, you know give the result of uh, whatever result of that condition. Okay. So these are the three places where your subqueries uh, may occur. Okay. So most commonly we use this where clause subquery. So we'll see as we move on with the topic, we'll understand. So another, the next point that need to be uh, remembered in the subquery is the subquery can be used with insert, delete, update, and most commonly select statements. Okay, so these are the statements we use uh, subqueries with. Then you can use uh, many comparison operator operators uh, when you are writing your subqueries along with your subqueries. Okay like uh, greater than, less than, equal to, all those things you can use, the comparison operators and all. So uh, another thing, uh, the main uh, uh, point that you need to remember is, uh, first of all, yeah, whenever you're writing a sub, for example, I'm writing a subquery over here, select uh, some uh, A1, B1, all those things, okay, all the column names and all, and I'm writing from table name, okay and where uh, some expression uh, so then i'm specifying an operator over here operator in the sense equal to all those things then within these bracket i'm writing a another uh, query like uh, for example let me say select and uh, again some b1 and all something uh, then from table table okay so we know that this is a subquery okay so this is going to be our subquery so sorry this is our uh, what do you say the syntax is like this and the one within the bracket you know here this is called a subquery or else we can call it as an uh, inner query or an nested query whatever so whatever query that's outside is called as our parent query okay so uh, what happens is uh, that we need to remember is whenever we are writing our subquery and executing it always first the inner query will get executed that is the inner query will get executed and the result is uh, given based on the result the outer query will uh, execute okay that you need to remember so whenever we are uh, we are executing our subquery just remember that inner query will um, execute first and then based on the result of inner query the outer query the outer query will execute okay this is the uh, main point okay so this is how the syntax of the um, whatever the subquery that you call will look like so what i'll do is um, i'll stop over here and um, we'll see how we can uh, you know make use of the subquery uh, you by writing a query and uh, in the next tutorial okay so hope you guys have understood these points and all if there are any queries then uh, let me know i have uh, already mentioned my mail id in all my tutorial videos and also please um, support me more and uh, and also you know like my videos and um, if there are any comments uh, then please do uh, comment below this video and thank you very much for watching